Hello creative people, welcome back to another brand new video by Amit Rabbi. In this video, I am going to show you 5 tips and tricks to make your footage cinematic in Adobe Premiere Pro CC. So guys, we have a great tutorial for today, so let's get started and have some fun. Number one is to color grade your footage in Adobe Premiere Pro. Go to Lumetri Color and you will find some color presets in it. You can use any of this color preset in your video. Now see the before and the after and you will find the difference. Also you can increase or decrease the intensity to make it more perfect. Also you can use some vignette to get cinematic look. Now see the before and the after. I think you have found some improvement. Number 2. Cinematic black bars. These black bars are able to increase the look of your footage. Go to title, new title and default still to open new title window. Now draw the black bars for your footage. Hold Alter and drag to make a copy of it. Now drag the black bars on the timeline. The footage is looking more cinematic now. Number 3. Camera Direction Using the same camera direction is more cinematic than opposite direction. When a shot finished, try to use another footage with the same camera direction. This is not cinematically professional. Yeah, it looks cinematic now. Number 4. Removing Camera Shaking Professional cinematographers use gimbals to take shots without shakiness. But if you do not have any tripods or gimbals then you don't need to worry because Premiere Pro has its own effect to remove camera shakiness. Go to Effects and search for Warp Stabilizer. Then drag and drop it on the video. Then go to effects control and you will see the progress. The shakiness is now removed.
Now see the before and the after. I think you find the difference. Number 5. Add slow motion to your video. Because slow motion increases the video's professionality. You can also create fake slow motion in your video. Right click on your video and go to speed duration. Now decrease the speed as much as you need. Also you can press R for stretch too. Now the video looks slow motion although it's a 30 frames per second video. So guys I really hope that you enjoyed the video, give a thumbs up to my video, also subscribe my channel for more videos. Thank you, see you next time, till then have some fun.